the key, I mean, you can talk about all the different variables and whose diet is the best and whose diet ain't the best and why my diet is the best and all the macros and every other thing you can scientifically break it down to. But what it actually breaks down to for me is simple. If you don't have the discipline to stick with whatever your diet is or whatever you profess to be the best, whether you're king carnivore or plant-based by my, like myself, if you don't have the discipline to stick with it, your diet ain't shit. It is useless. You can have the prettiest car in the world, the most expensive Lamborghini, a Rolls Royce, and no gas in that motherfucker, and you ain't going nowhere. So you, your discipline is your gas. Without your discipline, your diet is useless. So you can tell me all the reasons why your shit is the best, but without the discipline, your shit and you ain't shit. It's just that simple. No discipline, your diet is useless. Just that plain and simple. So you can get mad, you can fuck that old man, all you want to. Still don't change the fact, shit useless. One of the major concerns about plant-based diets is not getting enough protein, not getting enough good protein. There's a whole lot of protein out there, but you want to get good plant-based Protein. I get all the good protein that I need on my plant-based diet. I like to just put a little hot water in there, mix it up to the consistency that you like, and I got a hot breakfast in two minutes flat. I ain't the neatest motherfucker in the world, but so what? I'm a motherfucking weightlifter. <laughs> I pick shit up and I put shit down. Oh boy, oh boy. Mm -mm. So I hate to sound like one. But I do my best to stay away from sounding like a fucking used car salesman. But the best thing I can tell you, try the shit for yourself. If you like it, keep using it. And if you don't, don't use the shit no more. Motherfucker. <laughs> How's that for a sales pitch?